Guys, here's a, another do-it-yourself project right here. So we've got a leak on that end of the garage over there, but there's no shutoff valve for it, and it goes up into the ceiling and all through this finished ceiling. So what we're going to have to do is shut off the main water shutoff coming into the house. However, it's solid, and I'm afraid if I do that, force it, it's just going to break and cause a leak. So we've shut the water off at the meter, at the curb, and now we're going to cut this off. There's not much room to have flex, and we've got a slip-on valve and a gate valve to replace that so that we can work on the other. Okay, you want to clean the copper off real well. We're getting ready to cut it and put in the new fitting. All right, so I carefully cut the old valve out and now we'll begin to put in a replacement right there. All right, so I installed the shut off gate valve there. Then I got the slip that's gonna go in there and I cut a piece of this three quarter inch PEX to go up in there. And then once I got it attached, I'll slide this down out of that and it'll close off the gap. All right, so here's how I decided to do it. Okay, I put the valve directly onto the copper, okay? And then put this slip joint right here, put it up into the copper up here. Already had this piece of PEX slid up into here, put this in place, put the tool on here to give me some slack, and then drop this down into the valve. So there's the fix.